Hello, everybody. So you've gotten this batch of plastic things. They were 3D printed. They're cardboard connectors. They're little things to connect some cardboard. But the cardboard you want to use is food boxes. So think your pasta boxes, your macaroni and cheese. Think your cereal boxes. Think cracker boxes. Um, things like that. Thin cardboard. Um, also, like 12-pack, 10-pack, 8-pack of pop works also. Thin cardboard, not corrugated thick cardboard. These were designed for thin cardboard. So you should have six or eight different shapes in your kit. There's going to be a 90, a 180, a 360, a T, and then um, some angles. You should have an acute angle and an obtuse angle. Some kits will have two different angles they're hard to tell the difference between because they're very close but there should be a if you have all of them it would be a 45 and a 60 and then a 120 and a 135 so those are the the parts you should have um, you, you know sort them how you want to sort them you're gonna have different colors uh, than are represented here and because they're 3d printed on different machines there's going to be a little bit of variation and how they hold the cardboard okay now these are you know holding this cardboard pretty well um, but every machine prints things just a little bit differently and if it's not snug enough for what you need just get a piece of paper a little small piece of paper and get it in there it doesn't have to be this big right just you know, kind of cuts it off so if it's not snug enough for you uh, just put it in. Hopefully it's not too snug. Now I will tell you uh, Let's see do I have it here like on this piece of cardboard. There's some double here uh, There was like some glue and some of the other that one's gonna be tough to get in a little bit tougher to get in because it's a little bit thicker So be aware of that cut up your boxes after you've emptied them after they've been emptied not just poured them out or took the package out Hang out, they, they become empty. Cut them up, cut them up into rectangles, uh, triangles, uh, circles, whatever you know, whole variety of shapes. And then you know, we want to we want to build stuff with it. So uh, let's just make a box here. So I'm just gonna take my 90, put a 90 here, look for some more 90s, put my 90 over here. Now, depending on how big of a piece you make, you might want more than. Um, one on a side that's why we tried to give you a whole bunch you know to do what you need to do to get this thing together okay this now that that's gonna be tough because that's a double thickness you know just trying to get this together and I'm just like I can I can use the 360 I can use the T over here it just gives me some possibilities right now I can go out, I can go off this way too, right? Yes, I can. Uh, can I get a couple 90, more 90s? It's hard to say which of what, how many of each shape should we get in the kits. Um, but the design, you know, if, if we can get you more, give us a yell, maybe we can get you more. So there we got a nice little box with a nice little wing off the side. Uh, build, I mean, you can build it. I mean, I cut my cardboard a little big. You might want to cut your cardboard a little smaller. Um, and you probably want to measure and draw and cut on the lines. Uh, and you'll measure a rectangle, measure a square, measure a circle, draw it on there with pencil um, to get, you know, better. I just, I was bad. I just, you know, kind of randomly uh, cut them. So I want to get like a roof kind of thing here. So I'm grab a couple angles. Um, you might want to mark somehow. You know, look at all of your angled ones and like mark them somehow. So you know which is which. Is, which are the same. Um, so there's our little bit of an angle going. Yeah, I'm just putting things together. And that's the fun. Just you know, build some things. Now, can we go? Can we go higher? Yes, we can go higher. We can build up. That's the idea. So just you know, build. You know, when you when you're done, you just you know take it back apart. Get some 
you know, they come they come apart real easily. That's why you know we we're not using glue and and duct tape or scotch tape. These things are just gonna easy to prototype. They just come back apart and go there. Um, so again, you should have six or eight pieces, six or eight different pieces. Um, the differences would be how many of the angle, how many of the angles you got. And then they're going to be different color. Uh, they are three D printed, so there's going to be a little bit of differences between them, between how they fit, because different printers print things a little differently. And they are for food boxes, not corrugated cardboard, not Amazon boxes. So there we go. Have fun. Thanks.